So this is going to be a little bit of improv here, but I just got this guy in the mail. I wasn't expecting it until tomorrow. Seeing as how so many people are waiting for them to arrive in the mail as their first impressions. They're kind of new on the market. Thought I would uh, go ahead and give my initial review of it. I haven't really done any combat testing with it, obviously. Um, but, uh, yeah, so this is the Arming Sword from Lanskanisht Emporium. I probably messed that up, but I did my best. Um... It is one of the ones that is sold uh, over Etsy, the ones, the new ones out of Hungary. Lots of people have been talking about these, asking how the fetters are, asking how the messes are. Well, I went ahead and ordered one of the arming swords. You can see right here, it is living up to the, uh, the description. It's very rough. The metal isn't really highly polished. The leather is nice and just, just cheap metal. I think it's got a plywood core. Just simple, keeping costs nice and cheap. Um, as you can see right here, I've marked the point of balance roughly. It's about 11 centimeters from the guard. Um, generally, it is fairly light, but uh, it does feel good in the hands. Um, as is kind of expected, it is a little bit rough like in terms of how it, how it holds, like how it feels in your hand. Um, I'm thinking of sanding down these little parts of the cross guard right here because they are a little sharp. But um, generally speaking, I'm already very happy with it. It's, it lives up to the weight and measure, uh, measurements that I was asking for. Um, it is, I think, sparring safe. You can kind of see here. It has enough flex to it. Just right there in the front third of the blade. Um, the tip is mildly spatulated, so and it's it is a nice nice flat tip, but um that being said, might still need a little bit of modification, maybe put like a tip on it or something like that. always easy to do um, beyond that uh this is just kind of an initial review, so I mean I guess packaging as well people always want to know about that it did come with really just nice standard packaging um, came with a tracking number the uh, the communication throughout the process was great um, he updated me about like any setbacks they had um, let me know when uh, <laughs> when there were only a couple setbacks so that's also nice too I mean he was very open and honest and delivered the product relatively on time which is you know Important in the human community when some people are still waiting years later for their swords. Um, what else? What else? Yeah. Um, just generally a good budget sword, seems like, from the first impressions. Um, it handles very similar to a couple of, of the Regenier arming swords that I've handled, um, which is sort of what I asked for, so it's nice to see that he either does that by default or just knows enough about the products themselves to be able to recreate that. Um, I probably will do a follow-up video sometime in the coming months once I figure out how to really destroy this thing. Um, the people over at, uh, Cron LA are gonna help me out with that. So, yeah, thanks for watching.